How we doing YouTube? Here today with a cigar review. Today I have the Asylum Straight Jacket. Beautiful stick. Beautiful stick. Got one of these at uh, Cigar Fest out in May. So I figured I'd put it on YouTube. Let you guys have a review for it. This is a full body with a Nicaraguan wrapper. Very nice brown wrapper there. With Honduras fillers. A um, little uh, description of it. it says the brainchild of uh, Kristen Irero and Tom Lazuka. Asylum Straight Jacket is not for the timid. This is their strongest blend to date, and boy, does it deliver on that promise. Roll by hand at Ila Aldino Factory. Straight Jacket is the first limited edition blend from asylum straight jacket is an all nicaraguan puro with a smooth chocolate wide brown wrapper um, but even more impressive that the wrapper is the band featuring an edgy illustrated straight jacket it really sets the tone for the cigar a dense intensive flavor powerhouse is 100 percent consistent from start to Start to finish, notes of earth, pepper, cocoa, coffee gradually reveal themselves, but in a way that means business. In this instance, it's okay to go a little loco. So, that's what we got here. This one, if I haven't already said, is a Robusto 5x50. Also comes in a uh, Gordo 6x60, Toro 6x54, or a double Churchill, which is a 7x70. Seven this one right here is a perfect size, especially for this little powerhouse. I've already lit it, as you see. Um, first impressions, of always. Um, very nice. Uh, the pepper is there. It's, uh, you know, your straight up pepper flavors. A um, little bit of earth. Um, picking a little bit of natural sweetness from, you know, that, that like it described as the chocolateness, very nice stick. Um, burn so far, I'm about quarter of an inch, half inch in. Not burns pretty good. Not a problem there with the burn. Lots of smoke output. Very nice. Very nice. As you can see the band here. Person with their arms crossed, edgy straight jacket as described. Nice little metallic red in there. Very nice. Pick up the full body in it right away. As you can see, tons of smoke pouring out of it, tons of flavor. Get that pepper, earthiness, tiny bit of that, that that sweetness every time we take a puff. Very nice. Okay. Now, we'll see if these flavors transition. <clears throat> I'll come back in a little bit and give you an update. All right. Back here at the quarter point of the stick here. Ash is holding on perfectly. Right around an inch. Not straight, but... It's there, okay? It's not burning that wonky. Still good. Not overly hot. Um, still, tons of smoke coming off this. I don't know how we can pick it up here. I'm trying to catch it here with the light, but still putting off lots of smoke. Flavors died down a little bit. Pepper melded itself out a little bit. Um, not as high as it was before. About a medium pepper, pepper body now. Really gets you at the, at the back of the throat. Uh, flavor, though, nice, sweet earth what I'm getting from it. Nice, sweet earth. Good draw. No problem so far. Great stick. Um, my buddy went out to Cigar Fest with me. Loves this stick. Um, top 20s for him out of the 128 cigars that we got. So I said it's pretty good. They got a very nice, very nice product here. Um, I do like this. Okay. I'm more of an acid fan myself, as you can see from my page. But uh, I do like it. Uh, you know, I'm trying to get most a lot of these um, cigars out there on my on my channel for you. I had a lot of requests for cigars after leaving the 
um, cigar fest video so look forward for some more okay but so far we're quarter of the way down very nice stick very nice stick here um, so we'll be back again when we get closer to the band point okay back here at close enough to the band we got about two inches here holding on very nicely um, draw still excellent burn great not getting too hot yet um, pepper died down even more now uh, very mild pepper now still there but uh, not like it was before not that medium or high uh, pepper anymore very you know not very mild but we'll say mild in nature with the pepper um, just a real nice um, earth um, not as much sweetness either. Sweetness died down a little bit, but it's still there. I mean, it, it's still a very nice um, cigar, very relaxing cigar. Um, nothing, nothing, nothing too overpowering. It is a full body. I mean, it's a full body cigar by you know, but it's a very excellent, very excellent stick. So, uh, you know, you know, please try one of these. Like, look at that ash. Look at that huge, holding on like a champ. Use that ash, fre ash frequently. Um, you know, I hate it falling on me. It's very windy out today, if you can hear in the background. That's why I'm in the shed. I do a lot of my reviews in the shed, especially in the wintertime. Um, because of the weather. I live on a hill, very windy all the time, cold, a little chilly today. I'm not too bad. Um, but, I mean, it's holding on. I mean, holding on very nicely. Uh, I'm probably going to remove the band at this point. And uh, I think we're going to end it here, too. Not too much big changes. You know, very enjoyable cigar. 9 out of 10, I'll give this one. 9 out of 10. Um, like I said, I don't smoke a lot of regular cigars. Usually I smoke a few cigars. People have their opinions about it. Oh, well. But uh, on occasion, I enjoy a regular cigar. This is a very nice cigar. Very nice right here. Go out and try it. Leave a comment. Um, like the video. And uh, we'll see you again next time.